subscribe to one india channel and never miss an update The center has decided to fast track emergency approval for COVID-19 vaccines being used in western nations and Japan after world's biggest surge in cases in the country this month. Russian-made COVID vaccine Sputnik V has already been cleared for emergency use by the Drugs Controller General of India. Five more vaccines are expected to get approval this year. In the view of the rising cases of COVID-19, Kerala has imposed fresh restrictions to curb the spread of infection in the state. State Chief Secretary on Monday convened a meeting of the core committee on the COVID-19 situation in the state and decided to introduce strict measures. A maximum of 100 persons are permitted to gather in the case of indoor meetings or programs and a maximum of 200 persons in case of outdoor functions or programs. No masks and no social distancing in COVID-19 protocol tossed away. This was a scene at Haidwar Kumbh Mela on Monday as nearly 31 lakh people thronged to the Kumbh Mela for a holy tip in the River Ganga at Haidwar's Harkipori. Uttarakhand government made tall claims that it would ensure the best arrangements are in place to manage the crowds, but the ground reality in Haidwar on Monday was quite different. A fresh surge of 13,500 COVID-19 cases, the highest single-day spike so far has taken Delhi's caseload to 7,36,788 total infections. Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal today urged the central government to cancel the CBSC board exams. This is the third consecutive day that the national capital witnessed a record spike in COVID infections. West Bengal Chief Minister Mamata Banerjee, who sat on a dharna in Kolkata to protest against the EC ban on her campaign, took to her favourite hobby and produced at least two paintings while sitting on a wheelchair in front of the Gandhi statue. She left the dharna site around 3pm on Tuesday after three hours of protest. No TMC leaders or supporters were spotted nearby as she sat alone at the spot. <laughs>